Welcome to Weekly Wonderland. Hi, I'm Epoch, and in this video I want to help you out for the third time, three years in a row, with the locations of the Twinkle Slimes in Weekly Wonderland. We're also going to be talking about what the rewards are for popping them all, and what is new this year, and just what the Twinkle Slimes are in general. So let's talk about that. Now, if you've never played Weekly Wonderland events, so what this basically means is that you can find the Twinkle Slime each day between the December 18th and December 30th. Now, on each day, it will be in a different location. Now, I will show you the locations at the end of the video. I actually have already a map and stuff like that made for you, so you can find it really easily. I'm also going to show you a trick how you can find it, um, you know, kind of how you can kind of cheat the game so you can actually just do all these runs in one single day, for example. But before we do that, what is a Twinkle Slime? A Twinkle Slime is the singing slime, it's the most elusive slime that there is. And there is a little reward to it. Now, first of all, you will hear it from afar, just like the party Gordo. Once you get close to it, you will hear it singing. Once you get close to it, it will play a very specific song. And after that, we will talk about the rewards. Okay, so once it pops, there are three things that you can get. So first of all, you will always get a portal that leads immediately back to your ranch, which is not that far in this case, but in the other locations, you will be quite happy with that. In addition, you will also get 13 different kinds of shimes. Now these shimes are basically function as music notes. Whenever you walk through them, they will make a specific noise. Whoops. So while it's quite cool that you can actually make music with them, even better is that you can actually vacuum them all up. Now there are 13 different kinds, so you can't vacuum them all up at once, but you can actually just take them with you and then you can sh kind of shoot them as you want. So if you have any kind of musical talent, unlike me, then you will be able to make kinds of songs with it. And as you can see, slimes will also interact with them. And just like with ornaments, you can also place these shimes in your decorizer and withdraw them from there later on. In addition, if you pop all the Twinkle Slimes, what will you get? You will also get the Shime Tuner. Now, this is the first chance that these Nintendo Switch players can actually get this because, well, before the Slime Rancher Weekly Wonderland event wasn't available to them because you couldn't travel back in time because it wasn't implemented yet. But now you will be able to get it. This is also a really great time to get it if you are playing on a new save, for example. The Sham Tuner has about nine different kinds of instruments and you can cycle through them and they make all kinds of cool little songs. Now the Sham Tuner was introduced in 2019 if I'm not mistaken and it had a certain number of instruments. If you actually played the game once again on the Weekly Wonderland in 2020 you were able to get the new instruments. Now, if you actually already have a save that you played last year during Wiggly Wonderland, you won't get any new instruments. They are still the same nine ones as they were back then. Now, Monimi Park has not introduced any new instruments in the game uh, for Wiggly Wonderland 2021. And basically the locations for the Twinkle Slimes are also exactly the same on exactly the same dates. It's basically a big copy paste from last year. But nonetheless, if you are playing on a new save or just have never done the event before or are playing on a Nintendo Switch, then this is a great way to get the Shime Tuner and a lot of new Shimes. In case you don't want to log on every day between December 18th and December 30th, then you can just simply change the date on your PC or console. Now the game Slime Rancher will actually determine which day it is based on the time that your system is telling it. So what you basically can do for example on PC is you're just going to go to your taskbar at the bottom. You're going to just right click on the little clock. You're going to go to adjust date and time. There you will turn set time automatically off, set time zone automatically also off. And here you will change the date of your date and time manually. So just change it to, for example, 18th December 2021, 30th, whatever you want, and then the game will think you're that exact date. Now next I will show you the locations of all the Twinkle Slimes. Now if you actually need any help to get to the Ash Island, Ring Island, or for example the Glass Desert, I will leave some of my guides in the description down below in case you need any help. And if you have any additional questions, please just ask me in the comments down below. But guys, I want to thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.